Hey, and welcome to the Bible and other fairy tales. I'm Linda, and once upon a time. Most people believed that we were the only creatures in the universe. Then, not long after the United States of America and the Soviet Union started sending satellites and men into space, people began to claim that they were being visited by creatures from another planet. Which is a bit of a coincidence. These people said that the aliens told them many great secrets, including how to solve world hunger and achieve world peace. These people also said that they had been taken to the alien spaceships, where they were probed and had lots of experiments done on them. Oddly enough, the aliens seem to have absolutely no interest in studying or imparting their life-changing knowledge to any of the great scientists, thinkers or leaders of the land. Instead, these aliens seemed most interested in uneducated yokels living in sparsely populated areas. These aliens also seem to think it terribly important that they leave absolutely no scientific evidence with the people they visited that they had ever been there. Which seems a little strange. Because if I were an alien, I wouldn't bother with country hicks. Instead I'd be kind of sad that Carl Sagan wasn't around for drinks and chips. And I'd talk to Neil deGrasse Tyson and maybe Brian Cox, cause he is so hot. Don't worry, Neil, you're hot too. And if I were an alien, what makes you think I'd want to talk to any of you? If I can travel across the universe, I gotta kick ass F of IQ. Why are you busy taking blurred photos on your phone and claiming it's an alien host on your Facebook post? And if aliens really have come to take people and stick things up their bum, than just eyewitness testimony And oh, oh, why do aliens only seem to visit idiots? The type of person that looks at you a bit too intently while they're telling you all about it The type of person who believes in the JFK conspiracy but thinks that global warming is just silly And if aliens really have come Crashing their ships into Area 51 Or making crop circles in fields and parks Or abducting people and then probing them in their private parts Then only one thing can be true The aliens who visit me and you Are all the learner drivers, college kid pranksters and sex offenders So did you like this song? If you did, then get your exclusive studio recorded extended edition of this song right now by clicking the Buy This Song Now link. And are you as passionate about championing science and reason as I am? If you are, then please subscribe to this channel and share this episode everywhere with all of your friends, family and everywhere on social media. And would you like to be the first to know when new songs are released so that you never miss an episode? If so, then come on over and join us at thebibleandotherfairytales.com and sign up for email updates using the link below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time on The Bible and Other Fairy Tales.